wonderful friends. As y'all know, I love flowers. So today I wanted to do a quick video of how you can dry flowers. So we're gonna begin with just um, cutting a couple flowers. I find that the smaller um, the flower, the easier it is to dry. So follow along and join me as we do that. So as y'all can see, I got some pretty flowers to choose from, from my garden. And you can also see that they are not too big. I find that the bigger that they are, the harder they are to dry. So what you're gonna need is your cut flowers. You're going to need a piece of just regular copy paper. And you're going to need a piece of paper towel. So fold your paper in half. This is super easy. So you're gonna have your paper folded in half, open it up, and set your flowers down. Arrange them so they have just a little bit of room. Just like that. Set that off a little bit. You're gonna take your paper towel, you're going to lay it on top flat, and then you are going to fold over. Now, whenever you put it in the microwave, you're going to wanna to have some kind of heavy casserole dish. This is just a Pyrex one. So when you set it in the microwave, you're gonna set this down, then you're going to put this on top of it. Whenever you microwave, you're gonna microwave, I have found anywhere from 30 to 60 seconds. 45 seconds I feel like is best. So give me a second and I'll be right back. Okay, so I have microwaved this for 45 seconds. As you can see, the moisture has came through. Take the paper towel off easily because sometimes it does stick. And there you have it. So now, you're just going to gently remove them. Get you a little plate or something that you can set them on. At this point, they are very, very delicate. So you do need to be careful whenever you're taking them off. And there you go. Beautiful dried flowers in just a couple of minutes. So stay tuned. Coming up, I'm going to do another video on how you can use these in your journal. Thanks so much, everybody. Have a great day.